So they knew sex. They talked about sex and they wanted to be careful about it. Um, right. Yeah, exactly. So fun. Yeah. Well, and, and Margaret, I think, was especially aware of issues about being a woman in like a male society and issues of marriage and how it was very hard to actually have a, a, a an equal balance between two intellectual individuals because it was not something that she had generally seen or that generally happened. It, uh, didn't. Like, it wasn't um, it wasn't socially acceptable. Women were supposed to accept that even if you were semi smart, if had if you been, had been allowed some learning which she got lucky because her father believed in that then you gave that up when you went home and then you just take care of the kids if you got married right right and and like her father training her when she was a kid like this is not a little thing he was a strict disciplinarian and wanted her to be translating the aeneid by the time she was 10 without any hesitation and without any errors and she had nightmares as a child because he was holding her up to such a high standard but i think she she lived by that high standard for the rest of her life 